YouTubers, Hankster here, and welcome to another edition of the uh, Multiverse Picker. And of course, once again, it's our uh, Black Friday edition, and of course, it's for 2015. And um, basically, I want to show off uh, my haul for this uh, particular uh, Black Friday. It's uh, uh, one of my favorite times of the year, right after Thanksgiving. You know, Thanksgiving is uh, binge eating, and Black Friday is for binge shopping. <laughs> So, um, let's just get started. Um, one of the first places I went to, uh, they had a big thing going at um, GameStop. And they, they even had ads in it, in the newspaper for once. Um, so, uh, I took advantage of mostly their uh, Funko sales. Uh, Funko Pop, the little, uh, the cute bobbleheads they, uh, uh, the, the company comes out with, they're really popular. Well, I want to start off here with the uh, first one I saw, of course, right off the bat, was none other than the Fourth Doctor. Uh, fourth Doctor, of course, originally played by uh, Tom Baker back in the uh, from 1974 to 1981. Of course, we did uh, an action figure review, but this is the uh, pop television version. That's a pretty good start. I already got a couple. Of, already got my uh, pop collection. Already started with uh, Harley Quinn and uh, and uh, Mystique. So there. Then, of course, I can't get away from Star Wars. And uh, right from uh, the upcoming film, Star Wars Episode Eight: The Force Awakens, BB-8. Yes, I found a BB-8. So. I have to take him out of the package, so I don't know how how he's going to bobble, but uh, can't wait to see that. See, uh, maybe I'll do a review on him for next month. And finally, uh, for the, this particular collection, I got to continue my Doctor Who, the Twelfth Doctor, Peter Capaldi. Interesting too that he comes with uh, his classic uh, sonic screwdriver. This is a pre-current season version. Of course, that, you know, that he uh, now uses sonic sunglasses, which I think is pretty badass. So, uh, that's what I got from uh, games. I go, oh, it's a video game store. Well, I was trying to find some game deals, but uh, nothing really caught my eye there. But uh, I think it was a pretty good start. So, that's uh, GameStop. Then I went to my local Walmart. Did pretty good at first. I you know, really couldn't find what I really wanted, but uh, from the ads and all. But found some good deals either way. Uh, let's see here. <laughs> Got uh, oh, these are all Blu-rays. Uh, this was about uh, four dollars. Bad Grandpa from the Jackass Gang, featuring John and Knoxville as the Bad Grandpa. Also for Blu-ray, all three, all three of the Blade movies starring Wesley Snipes. Hope he comes back because he was pretty badass in that series. And uh, at all, this was about uh, six, seven bucks. One deal. Uh, Want to get a little seasonal? I did get uh, Santa Claus coming to town, which was also about six bucks. You know, you know certain. Uh, you gotta remember at Walmart they. Uh, Different colors uh, uh, pretty much represent uh, different prices, um, by the way. Uh, black was like about, I think they had a couple colors for black. They had uh, for uh, the six ninety five dollars uh, black and some other color. They had a couple colors for the nine buck ones. And then they had um, blue and pink or something like that for the, for the $3, three, four dollar ones. This is from uh, Rankin Bass. I, I think I did a review on that before. I don't know. Uh, Dracula, Dracula Untold. I really wanted to see this in theaters, but I mi mi in theaters, but I missed it. Damn it. The original. Now this was very low price. It's in the blue section. Indiana Jones and the Raiders of the Lost Ark in Blu-ray. And that's a good deal here to get this for that price. It's like, what, three, four, eight, four bucks? Then, I got a <laughs> steel book 
version of Scott, Vil Scott Pilgrim vs. the World, also for about four bucks. And if anybody, is, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try to do a review of this sooner or later. This is a really great movie to go see to to see. And I had this is the first copy I ever got in Blu-ray, I believe. So, but uh, yeah, you gotta check that out. And then, French uh, got all for six. Well, this was this I think this was cheaper. I'm not sure. Is it not marked down? Not marked, but uh, wait a minute. Uh, not only got the all three Lord of the Rings movies in one package deal, but also got the first two Hobbit movies, uh, the Unexpected Journey and the Desolation of Smog. Almost got uh, the third one, but. Uh, but, uh, not too bad. Oh, by the way, these, uh, uh, pop figures were all about ten bucks each at, uh, at, uh, GameStop. Pretty good deal for a big sale. <laughs> so, uh, that's what I got during the day, by the way. And, but... I decided to uh, make another go-ahead. So I, I just felt I missed some things. There were some things in the ads, and I thought, damn, did I miss them out? So I decided to go back to a couple stores um, after I got off work that night, just around midnight, and I stopped by Meyer. That's a big chain of department stores in some states. And uh, I got some really good recent releases, low prices, about seven bucks, uh, San Andreas starring, uh, Dwayne The Rock Johnson on Blu-ray, can't wait to watch this, this is pretty badass, and this is for about nine bucks, Terminator Genesis, which includes the comic, the 22 page comic book, this is nine bucks. I found these at, I found these up front at the store front front in the regular like they have like like little mini displays near the registers of DVDs and they had these on sale at these mini displays they weren't like special displays uh, like most of the other uh, thing but uh, damn I was like, damn I better take advantage of that so uh, got Terminator Terminator Genesis and San Andreas. So, looked out on that. Then I went back to Walmart after that little excursion. And I uh, checked around. I was almost got, I almost got all the Expendable movies on Blu-ray. But then I just made this interesting discovery. They also on sale, you know, uh, TV series seasons on, on DVD uh, for about 10 bucks each. So, I couldn't find them in the uh, big, dis uh, you know, the Black Friday displays, but... I just went to the uh, where they're regularly stocked at uh, the uh, TV show section and um, found that these are they were included. They're not marked down. They're not for uh, Black Friday sale, but uh, these were ten bucks each. Well, just rounded around off ten bucks each. And of course, it's the first season of The Flash and third season of Arrow. So I finally got these. <laughs> so I'm pretty much caught up on both series right now. Sadly, of course, they did not have iZombie on sale. iZombie was on regular price, which really sucked because I love that series. But, uh, yep. Got these two. Uh, it's also a whole, it's also a whole bunch of, uh, of, uh, Big Bang Theory at the seasons, not not the current one, but uh, still cool to see that I, I got a hold of these. I was I just lucked out on these these deal for this particular deal that night. But uh, first season of Flash and third season of Arrow, and they're currently on their current new seasons. He Flash is on second season, Arrow's on uh, fourth season. Of course, uh, tune in. 
uh, this <laughs> this week on uh, CW when they had that big crossover. Heroes tonight, you know, they're going to have uh, Hawkman and Hawk Girl on. I, I'm going to I can't wait for that deal. Uh, but I uh, hope you enjoyed this uh, little uh, showing of what I got for uh, Black Friday. Uh, of course, uh, we'll be uh, going into more uh, uh, stuff for December. Uh, stay tuned for my uh, you know monthly update video. And uh, stay tuned here for more reviews and whatnot here on the Multiverse. Merry fucking Christmas!